Beats came in your damn it slate, of course, but you in the house right here with DC and DJ Amen right now. Got a young brother in the building doing some big things, Mr. Biggie Simmons. What up? Yes, sir. Yeah, man, I'm here in San Francisco, closer to my dreams tour tonight. Of is my course. reason why I'm here, yeah. I'm going to be at the Fillmore tonight. And that's what's up. That's what's yeah. up. So the joint's been rocking so far. It only started a couple days ago, right? It only started a couple days ago, and I already lost my voice. That's why my <laughs> voice is all scratchy and stuff. That just means you're doing it. You know what I'm saying? When you get out there and you, you lose your voice on the first show, that means you was rocking. First night, man. But it was, it was incredible. L.A. showed so much love, and we did Phoenix the night before that. And that was cold too, but my right. voice, you know. I feel you, I feel you. So, so you know, just just about what you got going on right now. Everybody knows Diggy, of course, yes, from sir. the show. And, you know, from, you know, you came straight out the gate just mm -hmm. going. You know, you had the AT&T commercial, and everybody was like, oh, Diggy shiny, he on the roof. You know what I mean? <laughs> and then it went from that to, you know, uh, the, the Freshman 10 yeah. and, and everything that came along with that. You know, definitely big up on the Cypher. You Thank know what you. I mean? Thank you. You did your thing on that. Yeah. And then, um, what was that, the Past Presents Future mixtape? Yeah, yeah, with DJ Premier. I'm gonna tell you, bro. Like for real, like that's one of my Thank favorite you. joints as Thank far you. as mixtapes to come out, you know. And and it's crazy to hear, you know, young cats on like the old beats. Yeah, like when you beats. got on the shook ones, I was like, oh, is he gonna do it? Oh, yeah. you know. So that's yeah. that's definitely dope. You know, how 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 is all this feel for you? Man, I mean, just the opportunities that have came up, you know, from me working hard all the way from '09 with my first mixtape all the way till now. It's, an, it's incredible, man, and even the people that embrace my music and listen and acknowledge me, it feels good because I don't I do not do this just because I can. You know, right. I do it because I genuinely love it and I work hard for it. Right. So the fact that people love it, you know, and they come up to me and they're like, oh, that joint is hard, or right. oh, this one was hard, it feels great. Okay, cool, yeah. cool. How was that, how was that uh, feeling to get on the uh, stage at the BET Awards? Man. The pre-show was incredible. I mean, I was like in my trailer. I was like shaking. <laughs> I was shaking. I ain't even going front. I was shaking, man. But once I got up there, it felt, it felt real good. All right, that's what's up. So you got the new single, Copy Paste, out right now? Yes, sir. Of course. Why don't you tell them about that, you know? Man, Copy Paste, that's the first single off my debut album. And um, that's what I've been working on, man. I've been working on my album. That's almost finished. It's like 90% done. Okay. So but when I get off a uh, tour... I'm going to finish that up, and that'll be out before the year's over. Okay, work. Yeah, but, uh, yeah, copy-paste, man. We're just letting it marinate, and people are playing it on the radio, buying it, everything. Speaking of playing it on the radio, why don't we just go ahead and jump into it right now? Let's do that, man. Right. This is copy-paste, my first single of my debut album. Right. For sure. DJ Amen, drop that on him, bro. How does the tour feel so far getting on these stages yeah. and actually being able to do something you love, and not only something that you love, but something that's really in you, you know? Yeah, definitely, man. I mean, I... Going into preparing my set, I just wanted to do something epic. So just the way that the songs are placed and the speeches in between and me connecting with the fans and the crowd and seeing the people that really support me and they know the lyrics, all that stuff is just like, wow. You right. know, I've done shows before, but, um, you know, doing this every night now. It's crazy. It's amazing. It's crazy. That's what's up. Okay, so what's next for you? I mean, you said you got the album coming yeah. out before the end of the year. Yeah, is yeah. there anything else that we can really, like, expect from Diggy that's going to be like, like, he did that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, my sneaker line, Shiv Culture. Okay. Uh, you could go get those on C-H-I-V culture.com okay and um those are right now on my website but we about to come out with crazy just stupid colorways you brought stores. me a pair nah I, oh! <laughs> I got them on me but i got, I got them sent to you okay we're gonna work like that out that. We're going to work that out. we work that out. Also, you know, uh, I know you got the Twitter popping, of yeah, course, you know. Yeah. Everybody always like, all right, follow Diggy on Twitter. Let them know what your Twitter is. Yeah. That's twitter.com slash Diggy underscore Simmons. Okay, for sure. Are you team follow back? Yeah. And my team follow back <laughs> <laughs> with, with people that, that support me. Okay, I'm not really concerned about them, if the listeners. Just, we're not really tripping off them. But... Follow, if you just want to follow okay. just to get it. You know, I'm like I'm like diligent with who I follow. Okay, but well, we gonna work some out. Okay, we'll okay, we'll work some out. All right, for sure. Of course, go follow them on Twitter website just so they know where they can find yeah. the music and everything at. Uh, Diggyworld.com. That's my website. All right, for sure. Appreciate you for coming through, my man. Oh, you already know, man. Thank y'all.